Like and favorite this video before this intro is over, and I'll give you this box. Okay, who the fuck am I kidding? There's no intro anymore. Don't worry guys, I will make a second channel intro eventually. Anyway, this is the first box, and I'm going to give it to you. Visually. Through mail time, we can share it, you know? So this first piece comes from Screen Monkey Man. You may remember him. He was the guy who um, I allowed to do an intro for this video where he said Hasbro was going to stop running My Little Pony. But just before I get into mail time, if you would like to send me mail, you can send it to this address. This is my PO Box. Every single bit of mail that I sent to this address will eventually be shown on this show. And just before I open the box, if you do click here, uh, there's an annotation here, you can click, unless of course you're on a phone or an iPad. But I only want you to click this if you have at least 6mm dilated nipples and, you know, you guys can talk about your nipple. Okay, yeah, okay. So without further ado, let's open up this box! I don't have my mail opener, so it's very hard to do. And guys, remember, if you or your friends do watch Mail Time, I would appreciate it if you could make sure to let them know that it's on the fucking second channel. I'm expecting this box to have a lot of pony stuff in it. Oh, guys, just remember, I do open a box or large package at the start and end of every single Mail Time. Uh, so I did just get through a large crate of mail that I have had for quite a while. I do have another crate, and then I still have quite a lot of mail at the post office that I haven't uh, picked it up in about three weeks. So even when I do have quite a lot of letters and and other stuff from months ago if I need to open a box at the start and I don't have any boxes from a long long time ago I will open a kind of new one that's more recently come or a, a package that's more recently arrived just because I need a box and a package at the start of, and end of every single mail time dear Max Mofo it is great to write to you again thank you so much for promoting my video got ponies and for wearing the cross necklaces I sent you even in the mail episodes after you received it in I would like to start by saying that the new devil may cry game is awesome Awesome. The gameplay is fun. The storyline is grippling. Probably the reason that there was so much hate for the game is that it exposes satanic slash Illuminati agenda of World Conquest. IGN Reveal gave it an 8.9 and basically said that everyone should stop complaining and enjoy the game. I did actually notice uh, quite a lot of, you know, touchy subjects in that game. Anyway, random question time. Do you have Dunkaroos in Australia? I, I think so, yes. Also, are you a brony yet? Oh. We'll have to see after opening this package. I can already see and feel this in there. Holy shit. I know a lot of you bronies are probably quite jealous now. I think there's a lot of pony related stuff in here. And he's also attached a drawing in here. I think it's a, an Illuminati triangle. Basically the eyes on the floor got 666 down there and it's. I think that's supposed to represent uh, the power of God coming through the top, smashing up the pyramid. Drawing. You can probably tell by, that, by now that I do not draw often, but I thought you would like this artwork of my own design. And there is um, also quite a lot more to this letter, but I will get back to you uh, personally on that screen, Monkey Man. Thank you very much. Now let's take a look at the stuff that he sent in. You already saw this dreadlock type rainbow dash attached in there. Let's look at the rest of the stuff. The first thing I noticed is this uh, Pepsi lid. It's like a Mario uh, swimming. I think it might might have been to promote the Olympics. I think it's actually off the top of a, a Pepsi thing or something. Correct me if I'm wrong, but you know, that's fucking awesome if they actually did that. The second thing we've got is Halo 4 Forward Unto Dawn, which I believe is the Halo 4, uh, basically the Halo 4 story as an actual movie, I think? And I believe there's uh, there's also like a Halo anime kind of thing, but I think that's actually like a, a live action sort of deal. Next up, we have My Little Pony, uh, Friendship is Magic. I believe he has sent in um, another episode of Ponies on a Train or something. This one is Royal Pony Wedding. Aren't you excited about that? And holy shit, it says I can dance and sing along to the wedding video as seen on Hub TV channel. <laughs> awesome. Next up we have Lollipop Chainsaw and it has a note in here that says Twilight Sparkle voice actress Tara Strong I believe is in this which is probably why you sent it but I have not played this before so you know I actually give this a shot thank you very much for that and the next thing we have is a toothbrush and toothpaste you might be thinking why would he send that in that's because it's Pony flavoured toothpaste. I hope they actually crushed up ponies to make this. No, I actually don't. That'd be terrible in real life. But also, um, the brush is a My Little Pony brush also. Next, we have something called Ballad of the Zack, which has Christian, Techno, and My Little Pony as three different things on here. Of course, you'd have to put My Little Pony on there also. And the Book of Enoch. Quite a weird mix of My Little Pony and a religious-based package we have here. Also, we have... 
fucking annoying orange. Which I think talks. It's got a press me button on the back. Hey! Hey, Apple! Hey, Apple, hey! Next up, we have something very weird and unique. It's actually an Illuminati game. I think it's a, it's like a card game. It's got uh, dice and stuff like that as well. It's got all the rules here. We've got a, a bunch of counters. Uh, we've got a, a one dollar note uh, that's taped facing uh, the actual pyramid with the eye on it there. We've got a, bu <laughs> a bunch of cards. This is very weird. I can already tell that, you know, there's probably a shit storm going on in the comments right now. But next up, we have Sour Patch Kids uh, lollies. I... I think I've had some of these before. You guys are always fucking on my back about, you know, that kind of stuff. Mooch, we have those in Australia. Or Max, are you fucking hell haven't you had any of those before? Anyway, I just noticed these as well. These are so cool. They're uh, more Mario related uh, Pepsi lid things, as I think that's what they are. It's Mario duck and a bullet bill there. Got the piranha plant. And I think he sent in this bottle so I can actually uh, try putting one of these on, which, yep, yeah, it's definitely a lid. I'm not sure if it came on a Pepsi. Seriously, uh, if any of you guys know about these, definitely tell me below, even though I can obviously Google after filming. Next, we have more pony related stuff. We have another rainbow dash. It's got a fucking dick on its head. Oh, that's a, it's like a little hook dang stuff off or something, I think. My little pony! trading cards let's take a look at these just to make all you bronies jealous I promise you oh, are these stickers on oh, no, those cards and then there's uh, stickers as well get a load of that doesn't that just uh, give you a big stiff one and next we have another one of these things that I, I missed obviously they're so cool and then we've got this dancing okay it's not dance well we'll make it dance it's a singing cactus that's enough mate and last up, we have an American $20 note. So thank you very much for that, Monkey Man. That's very, very generous. And I do highly appreciate everything you've sent me in, and I'll get back to you about some of the other stuff in your letter. Uh, let's move on to the next fucking letter. Let me just climb on my steed. This next one is supposedly from How to Basic, and even though he did tweet me quite a long time ago saying he was going to send me mail, let's just get it out first and scope out the place. So, uh, the letter says, Dear Max Mofo, I decided to send you some fresh shit because you're extremely sexy and you look like Jesus. Oh, and because your videos are amazing, I also drew a picture of you. I will attach it to the back of this piece of paper. I think you should frame it from How to Basic. See, I can't tell if that's specifically from him or uh, someone else. What we've got in here is basically How to Basic merchandise. We've got a badge, we've got some stickers, and then we've got some How to Basic fucking bands. But let's uh, look at the picture. <laughs> Okay, this is this is more looking like um, maybe legit. It's actually it's like a, a children's drawing with egg smashed and stuck all over. I'm not sure. Fucking gross. Yeah, guys, if this is from How to Basic, thank you, How to Basic. If this is from someone who's just trying to look like How to Basic. Thank you. Anyway, um, I will go ask how to basic if this is the actual letter that he sent in after I film this episode. Next! A little drawing of me! So this one's from Caitlin. She wants a shout out to Jaden and she wants to know when my birthday is. My birthday is on the 10th of August! Next! This one's from Cactorino and it says, Don't mind the burned apple on the back. So, uh, there you go. It's a burnt apple. Also attached is this very deformed Picasso-like Max Mofo drawing. I'm a squiggly arm! Dear Max Mofo, I'm a big fan of your videos. I liked it most when you called the kettle seller and spoke black person. Yes, person. From Lachlan. Lachlan. Let's see if this next black person sent me. We got some uh, can tabs and a rubber band. And this one is from Abby and she wants a shout out to Ash, the best sister in the world. Next. Oh, we got some fucking... <laughs> See the letter? Holy shit, I'm a fucking magician. We got magic cards. And they appear to be uh, quite damaged. This one's even got a fucking burn hole through it. And attached is also this pre-chewed bubble gum, which uh, apparently gives you flight if you chew it, which I'm not fallen for that. Next! Dear Max Mofo, here's some fucking shit you can have that I got from a Japanese magazine. From Dion. We have some assorted cards. Next! This one appears to have some leaking text. Oh, come on. I, th I think it's leaked everywhere. I'm sorry for that. It's not obviously, it's not my fault or anything, but something's gone wrong here. It's got wet. Even the letter's all splotchy and unreadable. I'm really sorry for that. Um, I'll put your Mario up on the wall anyway. <laughs> and this one is letter seven of eight. If you recall, this guy sent in eight letters and every now and then I happen to open one, I guess. It's also got a red dick on the back. <laughs> We've got a drawing of a fetus and a badge that says, you're my hero. And yes, I do know it's a Mew. Relax. 
That's my phone! And this one is from Rusty Doo. Thank you, Rusty Doo. Your, your name kind of sounds like a, a rusted over old shit. Next! And it appears we have some Doctor Who cards. Hi, Max Mofoy. I just wanted to say thank you for making me laugh so many times. You have a really positive effect on my life. That's what I like to hear. I think it's about time we open up something a little bit thicker. This one is from Todd. Jesus fucking Christ, Todd. A lot of UQ cards. And these are mostly all the old ones because I actually recognise these. Hey, Max, I'm moving. So whilst I was looking through all my junk in my cupboard, I thought of you. Great. Have some Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Hope you enjoy. Big shout out to Randall from Todd. Thank you, Todd. Big shout out to Randall. <laughs> All I can think of is the creepy guy from Monsters, Inc. I believe this one has come quite a long way. Hi, I like your video. It was awesome. Uh, you've seen one video? I was too scared to send you mail. Full stop. Please keep up the good work. Full stop. This is the first time I send a mail. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to laugh at your English. Can you tell my friend... Peace. Finish the video you- oh, oh, his name is Peace? I thought you, I thought you wanted me to tell him Peace. Finish the video you bitch. That's to you Peace, you cheeky dog. Next! Max with a, a fucking flower. I know how much you love Pokemon so I made you a Pikachu. It took me a very long time to draw it. And uh, here's the pic- he looks kind of uh, sexual in a way. I'm not sure why. He's got a... his thigh is exposed. My mum and dad will be going to the Great Barrier Reef in like three years. I don't know how far it is from where you are, but we can have a meetup. I don't know why, but it seems that everyone outside of Australia thinks Australia is like one pub and every fucking resident kind of just, hey, hey, go on, fucking, I know you and everyone else. There's still 22 million people living fucking here. As most of my Perth fans will tell you, they haven't even seen me and they live in the same city. From Sasha. Next. Oh, we got a, a dildo for a mouse. Okay, it's a pink candle. I know, I know. This one says uh, to hold this up to the camera. I drew you a picture that took a whole five minutes. Uh, we've got a, a picture that took five minutes. Me vomiting milk as a stick man. I don't want to give you a five euro note, so I gave you one English pound instead. You happy now, fuckwit? Question mark. Uh, yes. But this next one has a drawing of it, a skier with a poo floating out the back of their head. I'm joking, I can see it's a fucking ponytail. Oh shit, fuck, it's a snowboarder as well. Imagine if I left that in there without correcting myself and got the shit. We have a drawing of a Rubik's Cube. Cube. Max my phone, I think this might actually be the letter. Hello, I hope you like some of my drawings from when I'm bored. I love your pranks and when you open up mail that's sent in from your fans. <laughs> From an awesome fan, P.S. I hope you like Mario and they have sent in Super <laughs> Bros on DS. Thank you very much for that. That's very thoughtful. I'll put it with my collection of <laughs> games. We also have a spaceship. Oh, and a bunch of Duel Masters cards. Next. English breakfast tea bag. D, D, D. Again, a bunch of Yu-Gi-Oh cards. And a pop stick. Hey, Bitch, I'm sending you all of my Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Please give a shout out to I Eat Penis. Was that just so I, I would say that out loud? And please enjoy the tea bag. Is that I'm <sighs> Dear Max Mofo, did you hear the snapping of that paper? You are a legend. Please give a shout out to my friends Dean and Owen. Dean and Dion, I think. Your your O's just look like zeros. I I, I almost said fucking Dean and Onion. From Loki! And Loki has sent in this very cool Pokemon Black 2, uh, I think it's like a special coin maybe that came with some kind of collector's edition of Pokemon Black and White 2, because if you open it up it's actually, it's just like a, a very thick coin type thing. Not too shabby! And also we've got this Pokemon card deck, obviously 60 cards, and on the front there the only holo that actually comes in the thing is this sexy beast! Next! And we have a drawing of what the fuck is this? Uh, can anyone tell me below what this is? Is this just a black guy with like some kind of black clown or is it a lolly or... It's just that he's quite misshapen and it looks like it might be a mascot for some candy or something. Hi Max, I'm a boy and my name is Georgie. And I live in Germany. I love all of your videos, mostly the prank slash mail vids. You are a really funny guy who deserves to be that lucky. Because I love you so much, I've sent you some Pokemon cards that I had. And immediately, Georgie, I can tell you that these cards are definitely not fake, so thank you very much. We even have a hollow base set Hitmonchan in there. And attached is also a bunch of coins, and he wants a shout out to Justin, 
Leone, Sasha, Leo, and Hannah. And the last box is to be opened because the sun is going down and you know how much I fucking hate that lighting when the sun's completely gone because it looks like shit. Oh my god, are you serious? Look how- Oh, this is- Look at that! Look how brand new and good quality those Pokemon- This- uh, uh. I almost don't want to open it, but I'm going to because they look so nice. Honestly, you almost never see Pokemon figures that good quality. I know you probably can't tell as much because the sun is going down and the lighting's probably making it look a bit grainy, but trust me, it's good. Let me smell that pink deer! Hey, look, this one has a, like a code on its asshole. I'm a pink deer with a code on my ass. I'm a pink deer. Fuck, what am I doing? Anyway, guys, this was definitely a nice box to finish the show on. This is the letter slash drawing that is attached to it. It's like a nice little seashell looking thing. Dear Max, thanks for being the greatest YouTuber ever. You are amazing and I watch all of your videos. Please enjoy the Pokemon I have sent you and please give the bracelet to Xantia. I'm not seeing a bracelet in here. Am I? Oh, is it? here we go. Look at that. It's a nice little bracelet that she wants me to give to Xantia, which I will do. And I know, guys, I know this is probably quite a short mail time, but two mail times will go. We did fucking 28 minute episode. So if you would like to send me mail, you can send it to this address. This is my PO box. Every single bit of mail that is sent to this address will be shown on this show eventually. But my name is Max Mofo. I love each and every one of you guys, and I will see you next time.